Warning, don't listen to everything on the internet, especially to a random guy you just found on YouTube. Thank you. Nine nine. Lazada has it, Shopee, Cebu Pacific, and whoever business out there is trying to sell us these very low priced items at September 9, 2019. Mm, well, in this video, I think I have something very intriguing. You might know this or you might not, but I'm going to, to reveal something that Lazada has been doing with these schemes. You heard that right. I call it a scheme because I think it is. Well, I'm not saying that schemes are bad, nor schemes are good. For me personally, I think it depends on how you do it and how your customers perceive it. But this is something big. So without further ado, let's start. Hey guys, it's Matt. And I'm pretty sorry for my voice if I sound different because I kind of have a cold right now. So 9-9. Nine, nine. This is not the first time that Lazada and Shopee has done this. And I have never bought anything online when it comes to these kinds of sales. You know why? I'm going to show you why. So as you can see, we have a lot of things that are on sale. It says 90% off. Wow. We even have Shopee. <laughs> okay, so let's find something unbelievably underpriced. I think I saw one of these. Here we go. These jewelry stainless gold plated stud earrings were previously 300 pesos. And now it's about 1 peso. And it makes you think, like, what's happening? You can see that they have a thousand ratings. When you scroll down the gold star ratings, you would see that all of these feedbacks are very positive. None of them are negative. So if I found a mystery box. So basically, they're selling it for 35 pesos for a chance to win a Redmi K20 Pro one in every 200 boxes. Freaking 25,000 pesos. And this one is about 21. And... There's no price going below that. So if I pay them 7,000 pesos and they all deliver me this 200 boxes, I'm going to get one Redmi K20 Pro. However, if you go to the description, they have some discrepancies. It says one in every 400 boxes contain a Redmi K20 Pro. Each box contains a variety of products for you to try for the price of $2.99. Note, no return, no exchange policy. Nakakaloko na naman ng mystery box nyo. Actually, di siya box. Kasi nasa pouch lang siya. Kahit 10 mystery boxes ang order ko, sobrang disappointed ako sa mga pinadala ni seller. Won't recommend it to anybody. But um, 39 lang binayaran nyo. Pero may lakos bag kayo at long champ. Kahit saan po kayo magpunta, hindi po kayo makakahanap. Okay. <laughs> this is just funny. Oh, wow. <laughs> Can't believe I just made fun out of that listing. However, let's just go to the main point out of this. These big companies like Lazada, Shopee, Cebu Pacific, of course, need money. However, before the money comes in, there is one problem with these kinds of retail, online retail stores. They need market share. Well, Lazada and Shopee are both in the same lane. They are online shopping stores. And of course, they're going to battle with each other. Now, they released a big date, a big event where everyone can buy something. And once they get your email, once they get your phone number, you're going to be hooked. They're going to send you text messages. They're going to send you emails. They're going to send you notifications. And of course, they have your whole information 
that can that they can use. Well, look, don't take everything seriously. Don't listen to a guy on the internet. This is just my idea about this, especially that I've tried something similar to this. Businesses do this all the time, okay? They're going to offer you something for a very small price to pay or even sometimes for free, but that is just for the sole reason that they want to keep in touch with you after that small, small price for you to get buying more. Let's go with um, giveaways, okay? Usually, these giveaways have an exchange. You give them likes, follows, your phone number, emails, they, they, you subscribe to them, and anything in exchange for it is their leverage against you. They're obviously not going to do something for free without something in exchange. That's the truth. Again, I'm not saying this is bad, but I just want you to be aware. Let's go with services. Let's say, how about, uh, how about let's say you're at a dentist, okay? Have you, have you noticed that every time you do at least a medical checkup, whether it's in school or whether it's in your neighborhood or you just willingly go to the dentist, these dentists would always offer some free teeth cleaning. While doing the free teeth cleaning, they would obviously find some flaws with your teeth and they're going to tell you that you need some maybe um, braces, whitening, and every, and every service that they've got to tell you that you've got a problem. And then once you become aware that it might be a problem, is that you feel the urgency to actually avail that service. Now, I don't want to go through all this stuff whether you see something that's 90% off, 99% off. Just remember that there are two things that happen within these kinds of um, schemes. Number one, they boost up the price of the product and then they give a very big discount that's actually equal to the original price. The second one, actually, is that if they do give you a very good offer and they're not fake, they're not class A, they're not OEM, they're probably going to do something with your information and they're going to hook you up. Look, these are just my intuitions and these are just my ideas with this. However, I'm really enticed with it and I think I might some do some searching if I do find a good deal with a very good price. I mean, I, I won't disagree. I just think that it's very important for me to say this so you become aware and you don't have those very impulsive actions when these things come up but if you do find something that you like i mean go ahead i'm not stopping you just keep that in mind i i hope you got something out of this if you do please do give me a like and subscribe along the way and with that being said i'll see you soon